I'm excited to announce the release of my newest instructional, the Leg Lock Anthology 5050. In this clip, I'm basically just gonna go through what is involved in the instructional. So one of the reasons I prefer playing the 50-50 and outside Senkaku is I believe it's a lot harder for your opponent to escape the position. One of the issues in the, the current game, which is the, the saddle and the outside Ashi, is that your opponent will often hide their heel and that's actually the direction they need to go to escape. If you hide your heel in 50-50, it doesn't get you out of position. You have to actually turn the other way, expose your heel to get out. So you're leaving your opponent with a dilemma. Do they stay in the position and fight and then give you plenty of time to work your game? Or do they try and get out, expose the heel and risk getting caught? So I definitely use this system in competition. Uh, out of my last 16 matches in 2019, 11 of them were finished by inside heel hook and this is competing at the highest level, including uh, events like ADCC trials and ADCC. I use these heel hooks to win myself a bronze medal in the open weight division of ADCC at 77 kilos. So this instructional is broken up into three different sections. The first section is gonna be going over basic leg lock concepts, the things that you have to know for leg locks. And this applies to all leg locks, not just to 50-50. We're gonna cover how to control a leg, how to dig a heel hook, how to finish a heel hook, uh, how do you counter the leg locks, and then how do you deal with those counters. So these are just the general principles that are gonna guide you throughout the rest of the series. The second part, is gonna be on the 50-50 and outside Senkaku. So this is the, the main two finishing leg lock positions I use. We're gonna cover in detail how these positions work, what are the main counters people are gonna do, what are the concepts that you need to know to, to be proficient in this position. So how do you defend your own legs, get your attack, get the finish. And we're also gonna cover in this section how to deal with the current more common game, which is people using the saddle and outside ashi. So if we're gonna start playing this system that I use, then you wanna know how to deal with other systems and force your system to work against theirs. The third section is then based around entries. I do cover a bit on inside position, positioning entries. It's something I've covered before, uh, but that's essentially getting through butterfly and, and uh, half guard and shin to shin into single X or X, and then working to get to 50-50 from there. Uh, I'm covering a lot of detail outside positioning entries. Okay, this is using Delaheva, reverse Delaheva, and, and some inversion and K guard uh, attacks as well. So you can do this from close guard too. By, by doing this, it leads us is a direct pathway into 50 50 and outside Sakaku, so we get to play the game we want to play. So there's over 10 hours of content in this instructional. Now, that, uh, when you have that much content, you need to make sure it's structured in a good way. Okay, so. What I've done is I've made the, the chapters easy to recognize and you should be able to follow exactly uh, what the first technique you want to learn is. I've listed that as a primary attack, so you should know this is the first thing I should learn and then you build counters off then. And essentially what I want you to do is try and use these techniques. You're going to have some issues. You should be able to come back, find the exact solution you're looking for almost immediately by clicking the, the, uh, the title that you want and then you can find the, the answer to that and implement it in training and then repeat that process again. This instructional is suitable for beginners right through to advanced. The reason is we, we cover the fundamentals really well. These are the most important things that you need to learn to become a good leg locker. And then we also cover a lot of advanced concepts and counters. So I know you're gonna love this instructional. Follow the links provided and stay ahead of the game.